Funny Cave. Four careers damaged by photographs. Number four, Chris Brown. In 2009, singer Chris Brown was charged with assault and making criminal threats. The police report did not name the female victim in the incident, but stated that she had sustained visible injuries. Later, a leaked photograph from the LAPD revealed his girlfriend Rihanna had sustained visible injuries. Chris Brown received five years probation for the attack. Two years later, in 2011, Chris Brown got a neck tattoo of what appeared to be a battered woman's face. Brown has stated that the tattoo does not depict a battered woman and is instead a design from a Day of the Dead sugar skull. But I'm thinking, anytime you have to explain to people that your tattoo is not a tattoo of a battered woman's face, that's probably not a good tattoo to get anyway, no matter what it is. Number three, Anthony Weiner. Now, if you're ever thinking of tweeting a photo of your penis, do everyone a favor and don't. And if you're a politician who's thinking of tweeting a photo of your penis, then really don't. And if you're a politician whose last name is Weiner and you're thinking of tweeting a photo of your penis, then really, really, re well, you get the idea. Well, that's exactly what New York Congressman Anthony Weiner did in 2011 when he tweeted a photo of his penis to a 21-year-old female college student from Seattle, Washington. A month later, he resigned from Congress. Well, all I can say is, at least Anthony Weiner hasn't got a neck tattoo of the photo of his penis yet. Number two, Vanessa Williams. In 1983, Vanessa Williams became the first black woman to be crowned Miss America. Ten months later, Bob Guccione, the publisher of Penthouse, obtained nude photos of Vanessa Williams and announced that his magazine would publish them in their September 1984 issue. The photos were taken a year ago when Vanessa Williams worked as a makeup artist. She then resigned after pressure was put on her by Miss America pageant officials. The title of Miss America then went to the first runner-up, Suzette Charles, who was also black. And in case you're wondering about the order of succession for Miss America, if the current Miss America is unable to perform her duties, this is what it is. If the current Miss America is unable to perform her duties, it then goes to the first runner-up of the pageant, and then the second runner-up, and then the Speaker of the House of the Miss America pageant, and then the Secretary of the State of the Miss America pageant, and then the Secretary of the Treasury of the Miss America pageant. Number one, Michael Phelps. He's considered to be one of the greatest Olympic athletes of all time, and he's won more gold medals than any other Olympian. In 2009, a photo by a British tabloid showed Michael Phelps using a bomb and smoking marijuana. He was suspended from swimming competitively for three months, and Kellogg's announced it would not renew his endorsement contract. This cost Michael Phelps hundreds of thousands of dollars. Thanks for watching, and if you like this video, please subscribe. And if you didn't like this video, please subscribe.